Okay, so uh, I turned up the voice volume. I think some people were complaining about that. And uh, hopefully that's fixed the... Uh, hold on. Let me confirm this. Okay. So that should fix some of the volume of voice issues people were complaining about. And uh, I do apologize for not uploading any videos over the last few days. The thing is, uh, Alice can move, jump, strength, and use her float as normal. Okay. Move carefully to avoid the hazards. You know, as, as I was saying, I apologize for not uploading any videos recently. Uh, I've been carrying on some important discussions with uh, a couple of game companies and uh, making some uh, major transactions and decisions and uh, maybe I'll discuss that a little later but I'm going to try to upload as many Alice walkthrough videos as I can over the next 48 hours hope you guys accept my uh, apology regard this depiction of domestic harmony and order the fruitful landscape encouraged industry tolerance and cooperation loving families flourished happy children and dear friends Grateful for their well-being, lived for generations, secure, active, and free. But a sudden onslaught of alien attacks broke their fragile bodies and nearly crushed their generous spirits. What the? Okay, one hit and I'm dead? Wow. Let's see me. It'll say, okay, I still can shrink down the size. Uh. Whoa. I feel like I'm playing Mario. What the hell? It didn't even touch me. What the hell happened? Oh my god. Can you. That thing didn't even touch me, and uh, I, it killed me. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, I'm, let me get serious here. Duck. Let me see. Jump high, and I can duck. Turn smaller, duck. Fly. Fly, Alice. The sky is the limit. Uh, I, I, I'm guessing those things will kill me if I fall on them. Wow. I think I could go far to the left over here, right? Cause I saw something hanging. Uh, yeah. I wonder if I can go all the way down. I might, I might die if I fall off. Right? Can I? Will I die if I go down here? Let me see. Yep, die. I don't know. For some reason, I was just thinking there was some ground down there. What is that over there? I see something shiny. Nope, nothing there. Just my imagination. Whoa, 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 whoa. Where did you come from? Oh, damn. They never want to make this easy, do they? Uh 
Uh oh. Uh oh. Hey! Come on, give a girl a break. And by girl, I mean Alice. Cause I'm a guy. Oh, come on. Holy shit! Let me ask you guys a question, right? So I've been doing some serious thinking about this game, right? Like, do you consider Alice Madness Returns to be like a chick game? Like, a game for girls, really? Like, guys really shouldn't be playing this type of game? You know, at least straight heterosexual guys. And by the way, I am 100% straight. You know, but uh, I've seen some comments, you know, that kind of like insinuated that guys should not be playing this type of game you know as I said you know many times before I like this game because I uh, I got tired of all the other games I was playing which mainly were first-person shooter games and um, it's nice to play a fantasy game that you can um, that has absolutely nothing to do with the real world I mean, games like Call of Duty is actually bait like, well, the old Call of Duty games are based on world history, because you know World War II and uh, events like that is our Vietnam, that's a uh, Cold War that really did happen in the past, and uh, some of the characters are historical, I think. But to me, real video games are about fantasy world, like science fiction. Uh, being able to do things you would never ever be able to do in real life, you know. And I think Alice Madness Returns captures the true essence of what a video game is supposed to be. So, uh, it's kind of this, it's like I'm inside of a painting right now. I keep feeling like I could have kept going right and maybe I would have found a hidden area. Whoa, I think I saw, uh, I saw something over there. A peach. I missed that jump on purpose because I wanted to get this peach over there. So it's, it's not that I'm falling because I'm clumsy or I just suck at, suck at this or something. It's just that, uh, I intentionally missed so I could get over there and get that peach. Yeah, this peach right here. Collect it. Collect it, Alice. You know, I never even paid attention to see how much, uh, I never even paid attention to see how much teeth I was collecting from, uh, those peaches. So I don't even know if it was worth it to, uh, fall down and go over there and get it. I see a little ledge way over there to the left, so I'm going to jump over there and see. Oh, yep, yep. There was a hidden peach. But like as I was saying, uh, I don't really know if it's worth it to risk dying or slowing down this walkthrough video just to collect these peaches. When I don't even know how many points they give me. Yeah. Oh, that was a very interesting level. Um, apparently, I'm playing inside of a painting. Okay. So, uh, I don't know what I'm going to do next, but I'm just going to end this video here because I want to get it up as soon and as quick as possible just for the simple fact that I haven't uploaded any videos in a while, and I will get back to you guys soon.